How's it going today, guys? This is Big Al. And I've got another knife to show you. It's one I acquired in a trade. I don't know much about it. So this is kind of first looks for you, too. <laughs> but it is the Mossy Oak Stag Finish Hunting Knife. Let's get into the sheath first got double hold downs which you don't even need you don't even really need this one that's plenty enough and they put that on the edge side so you know what happens there but as far as quality it is real leather it is definitely real leather it's not the thickest as you can see but it's leather and it does the job nothing spectacular on that all right the knife itself Actually, the construction of it isn't half bad. I don't know what kind of steel this is, because like I said, I didn't buy it. What I've looked up, these come in like a three knife set. But I don't have the other two, just this one. But all these transitions, they're smooth. I can't find a raised edge on it. I can't see the tang where it goes down in through the handle. Like, there's no gaps in it or nothing. Uh, I don't know what kind of steel it is, like I said. I'm guessing it might be maybe a 440 or something like that. But it don't have decent, you know. I mean, it's got decent thickness. And she is sharp. The handle. Now, I know this ain't real stag. But it doesn't feel like Delrin or anything like that it, it actually it feels really nice in your hand like where it's got them little bumps there for your fingers to sit right in it feels really really good so i know it's probably a cheap knife you know but still i think you get the whole set of these for i think around 27 bucks i seen which one's kind of like the uh the buck 110 it's it's kind of styled after that another one's like a folder but eh, for an old beater can't really beat that the grip on it's amazing that feels really nice it does have a pretty hard swedge there As far as sharpness goes, let's see if we can get some. Eh, it's popping a few off. It could be better. I ain't gonna bullshit you. But, you know, the price you're getting this for, I ain't complaining. That's just one I picked up in a trade I wanted to show y'all. Man. Gotta go punch that clock. Y'all stay safe out there.